just a relaxing day. Came out at the came out to the beach right here where the hotel is. And I think the beach over here is called Pebbles, which is next to the Hilton Hotel. But there are quite a few others. There's a, a South Beach, not like in Miami, but South Beach and Barbados. And the water is just as clear. It looks just as nice. So today's just a chill, relaxing beach day. I may check out some water sports. Um, kind of hot outside. And then later we're gonna check out this fish fry party. So I have a bucket list. 10 places you should visit before you die. Barbados right now is a strong number one. Why number one? Because of the food, the culture, and every beach you go to looks amazing. Clear blue water and pure white sand. Barbados is the best place to go for your next vacation because it offers food, diversity, and real cultural experience, just like the locals. The food's amazing, and it's definitely family-oriented, but also has an aspect for those people who like to party. Every time I come to Barbados, I always make sure to check out all the beaches. Not just the beaches, but the rum distilleries. They let you taste it, taste the sugar cane, see, let you see how it's made. And I also make sure to check out the local restaurants. The restaurants have fresh Caribbean seafood. The fish is caught usually daily. One of my all-time favorites is Champers. Long day at the beach. Now we're heading out to the local fish for a but it's taken about 45-50 minutes and then we just have to look for some place to park and um, I'll let you know how the food is. I heard they're supposed to have chicken, a bunch of different types of fishes, mahi-mahi, tuna, swordfish, chicken, pork, lobster, but we'll see what the selections are.
location when you go in there for the fish fry, it is multiple fish fry spots that you can try and taste. And there's a lot of different entertainment. And now I'm on my way back to the hotel. It seems like traffic's a little faster back to the hotel versus coming into the hotel. And it's like eight o'clock at night. So it just got started maybe about two hours ago. The full fish fry. And the fish fry was pretty good. Like you can tell the fish was definitely fresh because they just took it out of the bag, the like little bag that they put it in after they got it out of the sea and then just put it straight on the grill. And then we had rice and peas and mac and cheese and a different array of things for like what was equivalent to 15 US dollars. So it was pretty decent, a lot of fun, different music, a lot of different people. There were locals as well as a lot of tourists and a lot of locals. It was a good mixture of people. But um, I heard that George's is the spot to be, to try to eat different food there. Um, but there were so many different vendors there to try food from. It was pretty decent overall. started raining the party didn't stop it kept going on you just grab your bank spear and take a spot underneath the tent eat out celebrate enjoy your Friday night <laughs>